Hello everyone, my name is Dikshant Rohodgi and today I am here to present our branch project that I have done with my teammates Aish Mevati and Anamika Shukla. We all are a part of ASIC verification team at Fine Training Academy in which we have studied C, C++, Data Structures and Verilog, System Verilog and System Verilog. And in the scripting part we have studied Unix, Bash, Tickle and TK. So I firstly I would like to thank Vayavar Gusha sir for giving us this opportunity to present our Bash project. The name of our project is post processing of pin order mismatch log file. So as we know that in the VLSI industry we use tools and the tools generate a log file that contains the information about the project. So we took a sample log file which is this. This is a sample log file that we took and as you can see it has 8000 lines and it is a very humongous log file and it is a very tedious task for any user to extract the information from this log file manually. So we created a project that extracts the information from this log file and generates a separate report file. The information that we need from this log file is the cells in our library that doesn't have the schematic. The second information that we need is the term order mismatch for a particular cell in a particular library. And the third information that we need is a mismatch found in a term order. The term order mismatch, the pin order mismatch and the no schematic found warning. We need this information to be reported in a different file. So let me show you a small demonstration of our project. So first let ask for three choices. The first is the fetch the cell with no schematic view present. The second fetch the cell that have pin order mismatch and the third are the fetch the details of the cell which have pin order mismatch. So uh, the second and third are little bit related. So because the term order is caused by the pin order mismatch. So uh, firstly I will choose the first option. So it says please enter the log file or type minus h for the information. So if I type minus h it gives me the information about how to use this script and uh, how the sample report file will look like if i for example if i write minus h it uh, generates a small message with, uh, which contains that how many arguments it takes it takes one argument that is a uh, log file and generates a sample report this and generates a sample report in this format so i again will type one and will give the library name with the log file so this abc underscore dot log is the log file on which i have to perform the automation so if i press enter take some time and it as you can see it, it generated the information so as you can see it has heading username library cell name and schematic so these are the users in a uh, and this is the library name and this is the cell name and as you can see no schematic found so it also generates a report separate log file for every three options so moving on the so as you can see it would be a very tedious task for any user to extract this from the log file so uh, while choosing the second it again says please enter the log file or type minus h for the information and I again type minus so it gives me the information about the this option so as you can see it takes the log file and generates a report in this format username library cell and status so I again will press 2 and will again give the log file so as it is a very huge log file it will take small amount of time Yeah, so as you can see this this is a very long list so see this this is why it take took so long so this is again the heading are username library cell and status so these are the username this is the library and these are the cell names and these are the status that it has the schematic view or it has a problem in any kind of view in the uh, project. So 
so uh, moving on uh, first we will again press 3 and it says please enter the library name cell name and the log file it these are the argument that are needed to run this option so uh, what will we do we will uh, give the library name uh, we will choose uh, for example let me choose this cell because it's and I paste it here and again the log file I press enter so as you can see it gives the username CI stand for check-in so schematic pin order layout pin order behavioral pin order if it is not not present it shows none so symbol pin order and it these are the term order mismatch as uh, you can see this is Z VDD VSS and X and it has problem here uh, it is true here but it is false here here and here that is why it is in error. it has a term order mismatch so for uh, for it exit and let me show you the report files so as you can see it generates three log report files this is the first report file this is the second and this is the third so these three are generated by choosing the option and it generates three report files containing different information that it so that it could be easily read or easily can be sent to the developer so i would like to thank you for watching this video and a small demonstration of our project and i hope you like liked it thank you